100 meters. Why didn't I just park? Oh my god, this isn't good. I got in the wrong seat again. Do some. Oh, Joe Angle. Oh. Right. I can pick up my. My med gun! Right. No! Put it down. Put the box down. I'm landing, please! Please! I have my vehicle in the back! No! No! No, no, no! No! What's happened? So I finally got round to getting us a ground vehicle. We bought a mule. So we're just coming to pick it up here. We've got a player down here. Hopefully it doesn't cause us any problems. Very nice. Very nice. And leaving all everything on. Why? Oh, wait. Why are we floating? Right, okay. So I left all my engines and stuff on. Why did I just start floating when I go to my ship? Why is that a thing? If we're in the air, I swear to God. Please don't be just floating around in the air. Oh, now we're good. Nice. Right, okay. Uh, do we leave this open? No, there's a ship here. I'm going to close it. I'm just a friendly doctor in need of uh, my ground vehicle. I thought he was going to be in here. I was panicking. Drake Mule. Oh, what? I have to wait for a time. And we're paying that. I've never used one of these mules before, so this is going to be cool. The only ground vehicle that I've used is the rock, the mining rock. It was a bit weird to drive. I felt like if you, like, if you hit anything... Oh, look, that's like a tank. So can I get storage boxes? Can this thing hold a big storage box? Is that what that's for? This is quite cool. It's like six-wheeler. Right, how do I get in here? Let's go. This is similar kind of way to the rock that you get in the front door like this. I'm interested to see how this drives now. Let's go. How do I... Power. My power button's not working? There we go. Let's roll. Oh, it's... That's actually quite fast. God, it's way faster than I expected. Ah, oh, this is cool. I like this. This is quite agile as well. Nice. Right. We need to get out of this now. Open our door. We need, like, a, a garage remote clicker. That's what we need. Click it open. So, I need to get myself, like, a cargo box. Question. If I have... So, like, I, I read somewhere that you can buy, like, the storage boxes. If I get one of those, and it's a big enough one to put in this, do, can I... Why am I stuck? Oh, my door was still open. Right, okay. Can I leave a storage box in this all the time? Oh my, oh my god! <laughs> right, we're, we're in. So... Do I... <laughs> I'm gonna have to get in and out of the vehicle every time. No. I can, I must be able to... Can I... I need some walking room, like, so I don't have to take the vehicle out every time. So if I get out of it here, I am guessing I'll just put me through... Yeah. So that's nice and all that you can just walk straight through here, but can I walk out the back door while this is in here? Oh, nice. Is it a tight fit? Shout out to you in the comments for telling me to buy a mule. This is the... Per he, you said it was a per good fit. It is a perfect fit. Excellent. 10 out of 10. That's a good purchase. Ooh, I was going to try and see... So I I suck with medical beds. I'm, I'm, I'm a new medical... I'm a new nurse, right? Do I... Wait, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not meant to be on this. Can I get my health and water up in these beds? 
I know you can like fix wounds, but if you can manage imprints for your current stat. Ooh, it does go up. Oh yeah. Oh, this ship's excellent. Oh, that's so good. Let's go. Right, so far we've, we've been on the game for like so long we've not even done anything yet. We're going to go do stuff. Let's go do stuff. What are we going to do? I got in the wrong seat again. This swear this ship's got it out from the amount of times that I get in this wrong seat. It doesn't even highlight when I press to enter my own seat. I need to just run further forward. So I had some issues. I got a disconnection just after getting my vehicle in the back and I had to go reclaim my ship and my vehicle's gone. So I'm kind of sad about it. What we're going to do? We're going to do this. The expect outlaws are going to put up a fight. We're going to pick up this package and we're going to battle. So here's the deal. A client of ours who should have spent the extra credits for a Northrock escort had one of their ships attacked and now they need us to run point on a retrieval op for an important package that was stolen. Thankfully we caught a break and were able to track down the people responsible to Zephyr. We need you to head there and recover the package. You'll be able to ID it by its serial number, 859696. I expect the outlaws are going to put up a fight, but just remember they aren't the priority. Once you've got the package, fly it back to the client at Edmund on Hurston. One last thing, make sure you bring a ship that has enough room for some cargo. Don't want you getting all the way there. Ooh. So it's maybe a good job that we don't have the vehicle in the back. So I have plenty money in there. Uh, plenty money in there? What am I talking about? Plenty space in there. Uh, did I not track that? Zephyr, this was one of the new towns. I remember exploring this place for the first time not too long ago. So that's pretty cool. We've got a mission to actually go here. So we've got baddies too. We've got to be ready to shoot stuff. Luckily for us, we have an ambulance. I feel like this is going to be a really good daily ship, considering now that I know that you can get your food and water replenished from the made beds. That's so good. I didn't know that that was a thing. I figured it would just help. It obviously heals your wounds, it does your health, but I did not realise it did food and water as well, which is excellent. Do we have three deliveries to do here? Right, okay. I didn't really pick that up from the quest description, but... That's fine. That's all good. I hope we're not going to get gunned down when we come in here. I don't remember there being any ground turrets or anything when we were here before. So we should be safe. It's cool that we're going into hostile zones to do these now. It's not just like that last one that we did. We, in the last video, we were in like an old blown up, sp not space station, but it was just like a little, just a small station. And that was quite cool. I'd never been anything like that before. But there was no bad guys. But this time we've been... We've been promised bad guys. So this med bed may come in handy. Is that another player? Is this a safe place to land? I'm kind of... Oh yeah, that's fine. Nice. Right, now I'm hoping that this guy's not bad not gonna shoot me because since I expect resistance I'm not really gonna be watching out to see if there's players. I have light armor on too just cause I wanted to go for the medic look. I'm not really the medic look but I'm like I'm 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 I am friendly colors I'm not like all black and red and evil looking. Uh, we'll close this just in case I don't want him to like be able to run in and steal my shit. It's not too far away either. I would hope that people wouldn't attack the guy in the ambulance. This is where I had a really bad frame right before I forgot about that. I think it's the fires. The fires are too much for my PC. That ship is not having a good time over there. What is going on? I really want one of those. Are those in the game for purchase yet? Uh. Where's this package? What is that? Uh, should the package be like right here? I don't see a package. Hmm. How do I... Well, how do I do this? 
do I have to look around for this package? I can't even see what the number says. Is it going to be in one of these buildings? Oh, if I have to like search this whole place. Hmm, what is the easy way to find this package? My god, that ship. Look at this. This is, that is not ideal. Wait, the marker's gone. Is the marker gone? Is that, a, is that a good thing? Does that mean that? I don't feel like that's a good thing at all. Oh, the frame rate hurts my soul. Right, I'm going to have to search. Ooh, that looks like a box second. Okay, we've got packages appearing now. Nice. So there are three packages and they're all here. Oh, I like that. Okay, let's go. This one's closest. Oh, there's two in here. And they're upstairs. Where's the ladder? Hmm, a ladder anywhere? How do I get? It looks like they're up on the... Can I... Nice! Right. Okay, can I just set that there? There's one. How do I get up there? Can I... Scale the wall? There we go. Oh, that's it. Oh, you can get up that. Come on now. Come on now, this is just built to climb on. Let's, let's go. Come on. Yeet. This guy cannot climb. Aha! There we go. That athleticism. Right. Ooh, titanium this time. So I like that you collect them all at the same place. That's quite cool. You don't have to just fly here, there, and everywhere just for one little box. They were saying you needed a ship that could hold cargo. You could get... Surely you could get that in just about any ship. These three tiny boxes. I apologise for the frame right here. This is quite miserable. Right, this last package. Not had any beacon pings yet. What I really want to be able to do is assist someone in a prison escape. I, f I didn't realise. I don't know if there's more than one prison. But I didn't realise it was on Aberdeen. And I was just looking for somewhere to spawn a ground vehicle earlier, and I noticed the rehabilitation centre there, and I thought, oh, that would be such good fun if somebody pinged that they were trying to get away from there. That would be excellent to fly in there to pick up. Have, like, extra armour and stuff for them on board. They could get on the ship in their prison uniform, kit them out, and drop them off where they need to be. Right. in there. Ooh. Very good. Oh. Three packages on board and accounted for. And we are away. So now what we'll do is we'll go and see where we're delivering these from. Oh, we're not even going far away. Drop off packages. This star map can be a nightmare sometimes. There we go. Oh, and I can get my ground vehicle there too, actually. That's perfect. Drop this one off there and spawn in my ground vehicle and then hope that we'll get some... some pings for people needing assistance. We're not too far away from here. Oh, we're luckily coming in right outside the city. It's... I didn't realise this was so close. I think this was where I came earlier to spawn my vehicle in. I didn't even realise it was so close. I have my lights on, we're good, we can see where we're going. Remember the ping. I always forget about the ping, I have to keep remembering that, that that's a thing. Yeah, so get down, drop off this package. Well, packages. I need to work out how to do the whole getting a... Like, where do I buy the storage boxes that I can put in that vehicle? Oh, we've got some dudes. We got we got a uh, something down here. Oh, I got a random one over there too. Yeah, I need to work out where to buy the storage crates that I can attach to the mule. Because I have seen them in videos that you get these things. I just don't know where from. Okay, 
We've got some people down here, but we're gonna we're gonna play nice. Oh, it's friendly zone anyway. So, where's this drop off? So, hundred meters. Why didn't I just park? Oh my god, this isn't good. Uh. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Luckily, we have a made bed. If we broke our, if we broke our legs, literally just falling all, we got out the door, we fell out through the sky and landed on our own ship. And if we broke our legs, I would have been so upset. Am I better off to fly to the drop off? Because this is dumb being over here. I'm flying to the drop off. Am I as good just to land here? Is this a thing? Can I do this? Yeah. Right, now please don't throw me into space and drop me on my ship again. I feel like surviving that with no broken bones is kind of a one-off. We're just going to have to hope that nobody steals my boxes now while I drop these off. Right, actually what I'll do is I'll get all three boxes. Oh, can I just throw them through the window? That'd be alright. Okay. Box number two. Okay, I don't want this door to close now, so if we could get all these in here. Okay. Then cycle. That one. Drop off. Oh. Right, I'm just going to try carrying this, because I had issues with this last time when I did the Jump Town one. Place. Place. One out of three, okay. Wait. Automatically pick up another one. Place. Oh, we have a beacon. Right, come on. Place, place, place. Can I place over here? Come on, we have a medical rescue on the ready. Why can't I? Why is there a carry thing here? Sorry. This is not playing ball right now. Hmm. This is a bit of a nuisance, try carrying that one. Okay. Two or three. So, why will this last one... There's something weird happening here because it's not letting me... It's as if I'm not actually carrying it, so I can't set it down. Right, but if I bring this out, it sets it down. And then it just instantly picks it up again. Yeah, this is strange. I can't place it. Did I mess this up by doing it with the tractor beam? Right, so that... I can still hear my tractor beam. Come on, game. Can I... I can't, why is it like showing up a funny colour and I can't drop it either? This hasn't gone well, this hasn't gone well at all. Place. It's wanting to like place it over there. Well not allow to place. And I can't even drop it because it says that I'm, it tries to make me carry it. This is just annoying. Right, get away from it. Don't touch me. Ah, oh, it's picked up again! Hmm, this isn't ideal. 
Oh, something happened to our best carry there. Place. No! Right, let's go outside. Right, I can pick up my... My med gun! No, I need it. Something's not right. This damn box. Uh, I don't want to... Ah, oh, this is annoying. Right, where is it? Can I put it in my hands and that drop the box? Right. No! Put it down. Put the box down. I can't put the box down. He's messed up. Someone's broken. Right, so delivery missions. I hate them. Please do something. I can't... So is this just ruined me? Am I going to have to... I don't want to customize. Click the wrong thing. And he's picked the box up again! Why? No! Oh, and it's just ran... What's... Oh. Oh. Right. Okay. Okay. Carry. Did... Carry. Hmm. Pick it up. I think I broke it. I can still do... Hmm. Sorry. Right, so I can't carry it. I think I must... I must have messed this up by using the tractor beam. Because it does not let me pick it up anymore. Wait, where's it gone? Why did it go outside? Why is this so damn hot? Carry. Oh, he moved over to it like he wanted it. He wants it. You want it. Take it. Take it. Like the delivery man you are. You could be great one day. All you have to do is pick up the box. Why can't you pick up the box? But this... Right. Now set it down. Right. Cycle. I don't think I can put it on the shelf for the tractor beam, but he won't let me pick it up. He's just twitching it. It's moving. It wants it wants the action. Oh, is this another failed mission? Where we don't have a good success rate with delivery missions. Does that count? How does that not count? What's the deal? Is it meant to be yellow? I feel like it's not meant to be yellow. It is on the shell. Ah, oh, this is so dumb. Am I doing something wrong, or is the game wrong? I feel like we can't, we can't do this. It's just not... I'm guessing it shouldn't be going orange when I put this there. It should be going green, right? Oh! It was green! What happened? Okay, that, that gives me excitement. Right, do I have to put the right way up? Is that wrong? Does this count? How did I make it go green? It was green for a second. Right, so it, it can be done. This can be done. We're gonna put it upside the right way around. Where did I have it that went green? It doesn't want to go green now. Come on, please. It was green for a split second, but I don't remember where the box was sitting. Have I put it upside? Come on. It's the last one. It's the last one to deliver for the mission. Please. Can I pick it up? Yeah. I don't know why I can't pick it up. That seemed to... It seems to snap into place, but it's just... Ah, oh, this is... This is a disaster. Why did it go green for a second and now it's just not wanting to do anything? This stupid box. Accept your box. 
Right, so I can carry the other box. Draw. Still send two or three delivered, but now can I carry this box? No! I've just broken this box. It's just, it's just broken. But even though I took that one off the shelf, it's still saying that it's delivered. So can I place this one on the other shelf? Oh, so it snapped into a green position. Okay. Okay. Place. No! Oh! Hey! Yes! We did it! We put a box on a shelf. That was the most difficult box I've ever put on a shelf in my life. 12,000 Alpha UAC. We worked for that. Right, we're gonna go jump in a med bed because we were doing that for so long. We're starting to get hungry and thirsty and tired. Well, we can go spawn a vehicle in again since we're here. Might as well make use of how long we've been here for. Wow, so we got... Oh my god, we have a superhero costume. I look at a box in here. What is that? Sunset berries. Helmet. I don't know what kind of helmet that is. There was a loot box in the vehicle spawn room. I'm just waiting for it to spawn in and there's like... There's so much stuff in there. I'm gonna move and take all that. That's nice. It's just while I'm waiting, I had to ex expedite my delivery, so it was just waiting doing that. That's very good. I didn't realise that you got loot boxes sick like that here. So let's get the mule in. I don't know what's happening to this guy. He's... What happened there? I got like, shunted forward. That was weird. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with this guy. He's just bouncing up and down. Oh, I can't jump up there. I forget how tall these platforms are. We've got six wheels, we can get in and around and on anything. Oh my god. Oh, right, okay, we're gonna have to do some... Oh! Joangle. Oh! Oh. It's not a very smooth transition. That's what I've noticed. Right, out oh, again. Okay. Let's go close the door and venture forward. We got a successful box delivery mission with three boxes. That was <laughs> so. When when people mention about the whole uh, disconnecting thing, film the missions, etc., you think right, okay, so it's kind of an all. It's it's y you'll be going and then it'll fail instantly. There's no struggle involved in a disconnection. I had the struggle of putting a box on a shell, and that was a bit of a pain. So I am very glad that was we managed. Okay, I have this appointment mission. Outsourcing opportunity from Hurston Dynamics. What's this? I've never seen one of these before. This is new, so... I think we should all go check this out and see what this is. It's in the personal missions tab. Does that not usually mean it's a bit less than legal? I want to go and find this out. Because I like new things. Meet with Mr. C in Hurston. Oh. Oh, please don't import my vehicle. Please I'm landing, please. Please, I have my vehicle in the back. No! 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 What happened? Why? Wait. Why does it just... Why does it just throw me here? Oh, I swear to God if I've lost my ground vehicle again after I just got it. There's my landing pad. I asked to land and they just manhandle me to the ground. Do I have to claim back that vehicle now? Oh no. Store. Wait, is that actually just avoid the whole landing process entirely? If you just... Kinda float around in the not allowed to be there zone? 
Right, so we'll go, go look for this guy now. That was a, that was a, I've never experienced that. Ah, oh, I forgot to get food and water. I've never experienced that before. I've gone through the impound your vehicle countdown, but I've never actually hit zero. That's a first. Right, so we're going to the Transfers Commodity Exchange, and he's, his office is at the rear of it. I'm very curious to see what this is to do. Oh, imagine get this armor sack. It's cool. Transfer sentence. And it should be at the back. Is this dude like the boss? Is this his? Is this the dude? Oh, nice. Wait, this is going to be an actual. I've never had an NPC to speak to Hello. before. I'm Constantine Hurston of the Hurston Dynamics Hurston's junior outsourcing agent. Your contracting file has been assigned to me. Let's begin, shall we? Ooh. Don't be afraid, sir. Well, I thought we were beginning something. Is this the start of our relationship? You're going to cower on your desk. Wait, was that it? Did I just ruin the mission by having that tool out? I completed that one. Does it give us... So it doesn't even actually give us anything. I don't know what that unlocked. Is that supposed to unlock an extra... Like, extra mission? Well, he didn't really talk very much. He said, let's begin, and then that was him done. Look, I don't want... I don't mean to... Wait. Oh, thank God. I thought I was stuck in there. How long is he going to do that for? Does he give me a mission? Nope, I give up. I'm not standing around waiting for some man standing on a desk. Yep, he's still up there. Well, that felt like a little bit of a waste of time. What did I just unlock? I'm, I'm assuming that I've unlocked something. Like some kind of new line of missions. I've never had one that I speak to an NPC, so that's quite cool that that's a thing. I like that. This is so dangerous. The doors are open. Part of me kind of wants to jump down there. But I don't think I'll be able to get back up. And that would just ruin my session. <laughs> if you can see that there, we're going to pick something up. We've got another delivery mission. This is a personal one, so there's a caterpillar out in space. We need to go and grab a box from. So we're going to go call in the Cutlass Red again. First thing we're going to do is lie in that med bed, get our food and water up. And then we're going to go grab this box from the caterpillar. It was something that Nine Tails were after, so I'm curious to see if we have any resistance. We got told on the last mission that we we're going to have resistance, and there was no such thing. Well, it didn't say we we're going to have resistance, it just said that there was a possibility of having enemies. But, so far, we've been all good. Oh, I just took the tram to the wrong place. I'm an idiot. I was at the space... Wait, was I at the spaceport? Yeah, I was already at the spaceport and I came to the wrong place. Okay, we got here in the end. We've called the Cutlass Ride in again. Last time... So when I had this whole flying in here to land and then they just teleported me into the city and put my ship in the hangar, I had a vehicle in it. So I'm very curious now to see if the vehicle's still there. If it would let me, let me, can I, can I, oh, I'm already here, oh, I'm such an idiot, I've not had enough coffee today, hangar nine, we're already at the spaceport, thinking the elevator's broken, wait, sell, yeah, it is early, okay, it's early, I have excuses for all, oh, the mule is in there, Nice! So as long as I don't, like, crash my ship. I wonder if I store this and logged out. If I keep the vehicle in there. That would be good. 
This is one of the things that I can't wait to have the persistent hangar so that you can just have all your ve like ground vehicles and stuff at the ready. Oh, he's doing a wheelie. Uh, okay. We need to go in here first. Right, so our package looks like it's... Oh, it's just outside of this place, so... We'll set our route in for there. It looks like we're going to have a little flight to do. But hopefully shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, this is good. We don't have very far to go at all. Especially with being so high up, we can actually move fast. Okay. We've got a ship down here. don't know if this is... I still don't know how to tell the difference between player ships and NPC ships. Oh, this isn't the caterpillar that's crashed. This is an actual C2. I don't know how you know if this is a player ship. How do you tell? Owner, game rules. Oh, does that mean it's a player ship? Right, we're just, we're just here for a box. So we, we mean no harm. Oh my god, I can't see anything. Or my my lander gears are down. Right. What's that glint? Is that somebody looking at me? Oh, is that bad guys? What's this? Is this nine tails? Retrieve the cargo and the cargo's over here. So where can I safely This looks alright up here. Yeah, this will do, I'm sure. Is that going to be a player? I'm just leaving my ship. Survival estimate. Oh, it's a cold place. Right, okay. We got this. We got this. This is a very low gravity place. 130 meters. Could have probably parked a little closer. I hope it's not too difficult to get back up to where the ship is. Okay, that's fine. Can we go inside here? Uh, not from that door, we can't. It's going to force us to the NPCs, isn't it? That's what it's going to do. I thought that was an NPC. Oh, it's that. I don't know. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh my god, they're all stacked up. Is this... Can I get inside, please? How do I get inside? We're we're cold here. We're real cold. Is it warmer in here? Okay, so we've got the cargo. This is very cold. Right, so we're going to mad dash it now and hope nobody shoots us. I don't know if I just shot friendlies. Or if that was nine tails. But it's real cold out here, minus 50 Celsius. That survival estimate doesn't t seem to tick down. Should it tick down? Because it doesn't really give me any information. Should I be keeping track, like counting down myself from when I get outside? Yeah, I definitely need to get some thicker armor on because that's a few times I've been on planets and the cold's been the problem. Come on, get, get over, climb over the thing, that's it. Four wheel boots. Okay. Oh, can I just plop them on here? That'll do. That'll do. Close the door. It's lovely and cozy in the ship. That's it. Now to deliver. Drop it off at Reclamation and Disposal Orange. Right there. This is a nice single, a single boxer, that's a good one. I don't know if I shot, if that was bad guys that I shot, I can never tell the difference. I know that sometimes you'll have like your, the, the good guys will have a blue arrow above them, but apparently that's not always the case. So I just kind of shoot anything that moves. Because <laughs> even if you stand in front of 
a bad guy for a second. He can, he can not shoot you. I did a video where I went to Ghost Hollow, right? And there was, I didn't know what it was. I was just going there to explore. I didn't know if there was good guys, bad guys, no clue. And I went up a ladder and there was, there was a guy just standing there. So I kind of stood in front of him wondering if he was going to shoot. I was ready and he didn't do anything. So I dropped my guard slightly. I just thought, oh, that's it's pretty cool. There's just friendly NPCs there. And then he just started shooting. The panic struck so hard. I just started spraying all over the place. So it's not always trustworthy to just think that they're not going to shoot. That's what I learned. And apparently it's just that some NPCs are something to do with the servers. It's slower reactions or something. I'm not sure. But I killed them all and I survived. So it was a success. Right, coming into the drop-off zone now. I don't think there's any players here. Oh no, that's, is that one? Is this a place that people drop off like expensive goods, like drugs and stuff? This looks like the kind of zone that I've seen in videos for that. I don't want to get blown up. I'm only delivering a box. It's nothing special. There's cargo boxes just sitting on the ground there as well. I feel like I'm going to get shot here, to be honest. This could be the end. We're going to put full trust in anyone that's here right now. We're going to leave our ship open. No, we're not. We're going to close that. We're going to close our ship. We're going to take our box and just run with the tractor beam. There's a random box on the ground there. I've never been to one of these junkyard, like big junkyard drop-off zones before. Apparently they're a hot zone for pirates. You see videos of them all hiding in the rubble and waiting for people to run into the room and then shooting them down. Hopefully they'll see that I just have a box. I'm here for a mission. I have no good cargo. I'm not worth killing. This is where people usually do the business. And this is where people die. So, can I drop off? Carry my box. No problems with carrying this time. Place them in there. And is that mission... Don't do this to me, game! No, don't! Wait. Drop off. Oh, come on, game. Why? Oh, and it's fought. Oh, no, there it is. Well, why does it have to be like this? Don't do this. <laughs> oh. Place? Oh. Yeah! Nice! Hey, that was a couple of good box missions. We got them... We eventually got through them. That was, that was... That was nice. And we get to come to this cool little zone which had not been at before. How good's that? I wonder if they, they're ever operational. That'd be cool. Just see them smashing stuff. Nice. The ambulance. So even with all the issues that we had with boxes, not wanting to go on their little shelves and not wanting to go on the delivery slot, we still got it done because we are the delivery driver. So we're only like a few delivery missions into what is on offer. We've done a mixture of personal and the general missions. So there doesn't seem to be much difference yet, but I'm assuming that the more that you do, the more you're going to be able to unlock bigger paying jobs, maybe jobs that have more resistance, etc. So I do look forward to seeing that and I look forward to bringing you along with me. So I hope you enjoyed the delivery missions. I've made a new playlist. I'm going to carry on this series and I'm probably going to keep using the Cutlass Raid because it's handy having that med bed there. You can fit a vehicle in when it spawns and well, it's just a cool ship. It's agile. It's fast enough. The fuel's decent. If I need to put cargo in the back, then the vehicle can get chucked out and there's plenty of space. 
So we will catch you guys in the next one. We're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to start a new side mission, but you will find that out next time. So thanks for watching. We'll see you later.